In this video, I am going to compare two of the global powerhouse foundries which represent the epicenter of the global AI technology competition between the United States Taiwan Alliance and China. Their technological capabilities, manufacturing capacity and the customer relationship directly determine each nation's ability to develop and deploy AI systems at scale. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. The first company is TCMC or Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company and the other one is SMIC or Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation. Let's first have a quick overview of this TCMC which is the first world's largest dedicated semiconductor foundry founded in 1987 by Morris Chang, headquartered in Taiwan TCMC pioneered the pure play foundry model and has maintained technological leadership for decades. The company serves as the backbone of global AI infrastructure, manufacturing chips for Apple, Nvidia, AMD and other tech giants driving the AI revolution. People say that this is one of the most or maybe the top most valuable company in the world. Second one is SMIC. SMIC is China's largest contract chip maker founded in 2000 and headquartered in Shanghai. As a partially state owned company, SMIC represents China's strategic effort to achieve semiconductor self-sufficiency amid growing geopolitical tensions. Despite facing severe US sanctions since 2020, SMIC has emerged as the world's second largest pure play foundry by 2025. I'm going to compare these foundries on various benchmarks in this video. So let's get started. First and foremost, if you look at this table, this is giving you the market position and scale. TC, TSMC maintains an overwhelming advantage in market position, generating nearly 15 times SMIC's revenue while serving as the foundational infrastructure for global AI development. TSMC's 25.53 billion US dollars quarterly revenue really dwarfs SMIC's 1.7 billion US dollar revenue reflecting not just scale differences but also technological leadership in high value advanced nodes. But SMIC's achievement of becoming the world's second largest pure play foundry demonstrates remarkable progress despite sanctions positioning it as China's primary vehicle for AI chip independence and these numbers might change within months. Next up, you can see this process technology. The technology gap represents the most critical differentiator in the AI race, but it is closing very rapidly. TSMC's leadership in 3NM production and advanced packaging gives it exclusive access to manufacturing the world's most powerful AI accelerators, including NVIDIA's H100 and H200 GPUs that dominate AI training. SMIC's 7NM achievement and expected 5NM capability by late, late this year represent significant progress, but remains two to three generations behind TSMC's cutting edge, but that might not be the case in few months time. This technological lag directly at the moment translates to performance disadvantages in a workload. But if you look at the models like DeepSeek, they are also finding some software solutions to overcome that. The starkest contrast lies in geopolitical positioning, which fundamentally shapes each company's AI ecosystem role. TSMC operates as the strategic manufacturing partner for US and allied AI ambitions, receiving preferential access to the most advanced manufacturing equipment while facing restrictions on serving Chinese customers. Conversely, SMIC operates under comprehensive US sanctions that block access to EUV lithography and limit advanced DUV equipment, forcing reliance on older tools and innovative workarounds.
This creates parallel AI supply chain with TSMCs anchoring the Western ecosystem, while SMIC supports China's quest for technological sovereignty. The financial performance is quite interesting. TSMC's financial superiority enables sustained technological leadership through massive R&D and capital expenditure programs with gross margins approaching 60% and operating margins nearly 50%. TSMC's generate substantial cash flows to fund 30 plus billion annual investment in next generation capabilities. SMIC's significantly lower margins reflect both technological constraints and capital intensive nature of catching up. But remember that Chinese government might be helping it out. So which always is helpful for continued advancement. Then comes this AI ecosystem integration. I think this is the most important thing for AI race and TSMC's ecosystem integration creates compounding advantage through exclusive partnership with AI leaders like NVIDIA and AMD. This positioning enables TSMC's to co-develop optimized manufacturing process for cutting edge AI architecture while benefiting from high volume, high margin production. SMIC ecosystem remains largely confined to Chinese companies, primarily Huawei, limiting both technological cross-pollination and global market access. But this domestic focus may prove advantages as China develops indigenous AI capabilities requiring localized supply chain. Now, the SMIC TSMC's comparison shows two distinct but interconnected narratives in the global AI race. TSMC represent technological supremacy and global market dominance, manufacturing the advanced chips that power today's AI revolution while maintaining comfortable leads in both process technology and ecosystem integration. Its position as the exclusive supplier of cutting-edge AI accelerator makes it indispensable to continued AI advancement in Western countries. The AI race ultimately depends on just not on a manufacturing capability, but on the entire ecosystem of design, manufacturing and development. TSMC's current advantage in advanced node and ecosystem integration provides substantial near time benefit. But SMIC's role in China's AI development creates a parallel track that may prove decisive for global AI leadership over the next decade. The competition between these two foundries show broader geopolitical tensions that will shape the future of AI development and deployment worldwide. I also want you to introduce uh, you to the sponsors of the video who are Camel AI. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation, task automation, and world simulation. If you like the content, please like the video and share it among your network. Thank you.